Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Tuesday. Coming at you with 2020 Panini Mosaic Football 20 box uh, blaster break. Pick your team at number five, PYT number five. Tw full 20 box blaster case. No vet commons will ship. Um, also, we're giving away the Bengals. If you buy at least two or more teams, you get a chance at the Bengals. Two teams, one entry. Four teams, two entries so on and so forth so big thanks all of these folks right here so let's see who uh, let's see who's in let's sort this by column a Brian Crouch got two that's an entry Jarrell got two that's an entry John got two that's an entry Josh got two that's an entry Karen got two that's an entry Michael Gallucci got eight and that is four entries Nicholas Casper got two, that's an entry. Ricky got six, that's three entries, nice. Ryan H got two, that's an entry. And Sean Maddock got two, that is an entry. All right, so there's 15 spots on this list right here. So let's put those 15 spots there. The name on top after eight. Two and a six, eight times. Name on top after eight. It's gonna get it. Get the bangles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Name on top after eight is gonna be Michael. Michael Gallucci, Steel Curtain. After eight, you get the bangles. All right, so let's pop your name in there. Thanks to everybody else for giving that a shot. There is another blaster case up on jazbeescasebreaks.com if you want to try again. All right, so let's print and rip. Good luck, everybody. There it is, Mosaic Blaster right there. All 20 boxes, a lot of stuff in here. Good luck, everybody. Let's slide all these over in the back here. Nick help here all right so let's turn this camera around there you go it's a little dark all right so we're gonna slide some boxes over to him Let's get a head start to get this blaster break done more quickly. And that way we can get to some more orders. Nothing else was sold out after this, but a lot of stuff was close. So if you're watching live, go to jazbeescasebreaks.com, check it out. Nick, who's the next coach that's going to get fired? I feel like the domino, first domino falls with Bill O'Brien. John Gruden. John Gruden? Yeah. For going to charity events without masks? Yeah. <laughs> Did you hear what the NFL could could do? They, right? they could have what the entire have the team the forfeit a game. NFL threatening. They should make them. Tightening up the protocols. Although the Texans kind of had a tough schedule. They have some easy games coming up. I mean, Wi-Fi now, I guess. 
All right. Good luck, everybody. There's green Brian Dawkins. So Vet Commons won't ship, but obviously that's a green parallel, so that will ship. And there's a Genesis right here. Right out of the gate, Len Dawson. <laughs> a couple regular top loaders, please. I'm not prepared for this break. Oh, yes, it's actually new. Is it updated? Yeah, it happened yesterday. Oh, really? Where I just had to reset the stream key. Yeah, I just re entered it and then it worked. Yeah, it's kind of odd, but. All right, that goes to. Oh. Maybe we have to do that I hope not. I mean, it's not that much of a hassle, but. Um, there's the final printout right here. So, Chiefs, that'll be Josh Zetz with the Chiefs. All right, so that's a Genesis. That's a, that's a super short print as well. Justin Herbert, Dan Marino, Touchdown Masters, Insert. Inserts obviously will ship. This Curtis Martin, Mosaic Parallel will ship. It still feels a little dark on the top cam, doesn't it, the Nick cam? Can we brighten that up a little bit more? So top camera, Nick Jaspi doing his thing over there on the Nick Cam. Dan Quinn next out. Yeah. That seems to be the next logical choice, but I don't know. I feel like they should have fired him last year. Hasn't happened. Christian McCaffrey should be making his way back soon. Box, 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 and a box. Oh, that box is hidden. Box. Were there any surprises over the over the weekend? I guess Brown's just putting for, putting 49 on the Cowboys. That was kind of crazy. Matt Patricia might get fired next. But I'm not even on that part of the screen yet. <laughs> oh, man. Brady throws for five touchdowns, embarrassing Sean Jaspi's Chargers. I thought defense was supposed to be their strong suit. Apparently not yet. Anthony Lynn, that might be the next dude done. It'll be Bill Belichick fired. Bill Belichick fired. Um, Ravens took care of business. Panthers took care of Panthers looking good. Everyone thought without Christian McCaffrey, they thought game over. No. Bridgewater stepped up. You see him running around like old like Bridgewater of old. He looked pretty good. Vikings finally getting a win, so I guess. I guess that coach up there, I'm blanking on his name, will Zimmer, and this guy, Kirk Cousins, will last a little bit longer. Giants kept things closer than I thought, but the Rams grinded out a win. I thought the Rams would score a lot more points. My Raiders were not good. They looked weak without a couple of their rookie receivers. Their defense is just awful. Uh, <laughs> the Eagles, how do you like that? How do you like the Eagles? Nick Jaspi, big Eagles fan. First place. Are they in first place now? Yeah. With a one, two, and one? Why are you laughing? They're first that place division is just so bad. <laughs> right, because the Cowboys are place. terrible. Giants are terrible. First place is first place. The, right, for, no, right, there you go. First place is first place. Rookie Green, CJ Henderson. And Aeneas Williams. Old Cardinal is your first uh, first autograph. And autographs are not too common in these blaster boxes, but Sean Maddock with the Cardinals. Mm. 
There's Darius. Did I miss a Mahomes? Am I just passing by Mahomes is here? I feel like all things Mahomes. Will to win Baker. Yeah. Touchdown Masters Mahomes. Anything with his name on it. It's pretty awesome. That's another one for the Chiefs. Got the Genesis and a Mahomes. Green CJ Henderson. Yeah, that Russell Wilson Silver will definitely ship. Jalen Ragor, green rookie for the Eagles. Ryan H. Eagles, the Eagles look, looked pretty good, actually. Is this where it, they turn it around, Nick? They're first place. <laughs> this is where they turn it around, folks. NFL debut, Joe Burrow will go to Michael Gallucci in the Bengals. He won that in that randomizer. They'll beat the Steelers next week. Wow, they'll beat the Steelers next week. Yeah. Where is the game? Um, I think it's in, uh, it's in Philadelphia, maybe? I, I guess it doesn't really matter, right? No, no fans, I guess. And they, you know, it's not like you have to travel. You know? Too far, yeah. In, within state. Do you think they still fly? No, they travel. You think they, they, they bus it? They got to bus it, right? I think it's like, I think it's actually further than I'm thinking it is. Because Pittsburgh is almost Ohio. Yeah. But it's prob they probably are. All right, another uh, four boxes here. Your Eagles, yeah, they go to Pittsburgh. Yeah. Pittsburgh's minus seven. Are we taking the plus money all the way on this? There's Brady. Ooh, Eagles money line even. Ooh. There's a Buccaneer Brady for Karen. There you go, Karen. I know oh, no, some. Right there, it says that 5,500 fans will be allowed in the Steelers Stadium. Oh, does that? Television. Is that going to be enough? I don't know. Does that even make a difference? Yeah. Does that make a difference? I don't know. And there's a base Joe Burrow right there. Got his first win. I think what did I what did I see? First rookie to to go at least 300 yards in his first four starts or something like that was the stat. Was pretty impressive. Michael Gallucci. AJ Dillon mosaic. Rookie mosaic. Catch all the rookie parallels, much, much of them as possible. We got Javon Kinlaw, Niners with his uh, college gear on. A variation there for uh, San Francisco John G with the Niners. NFL debut green, Jonathan Taylor, Cole Beasley, Marquise Brown. What do you feel in this Lakers game, Nick? I think they Wow. Tying up the series at two, making it exciting. Right. We got a green Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Are we still are we still high on Clyde Edwards Hilaire? Elaire? I know that first week. Hilaire. Yeah, Hilaire. I know the first week he was selling like hotcakes. He might still be. Yeah, Arash still high on, on Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Josh. Do they really? <laughs> Boy. Jalen Hurts Silver. So Joe Burrow, NFL debut green. It's a nice parallel for Michael Gallucci and the Bengals. Do we see Jalen Hurts make a start this year? No. A non-injury start? No. No, okay. Wentz all the way. I mean, what a... 
So you guys have <laughs> one, two, and one. So you're saying they're going to beat the Steelers. Yeah. That's two wins. Ravens? That's, Ravens. Not a, that's not a win. Giants? How they probably they might beat the Cowboys. That, that that's a huge matchup right gonna, there for the division. Wow. All right. Five. There's no wins here. Six, seven, 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 seven wins. I see seven wins. Six or seven wins, which might win the division. They're gonna be eight, seven, and one. Wow. Eight, seven, and one, folks. And win the division. Yeah. Nice J.K. Dobbins orange, 22 out of 25. I love this uh, parallel here. What's up, Sean? Phil Hughes said, uh, "Winner of the Padres Dodgers series wins the World Series." Interesting. In the chat last night. I know. I saw it. Nicholas Casper, Ravens. It's a nice name drop, Sean. Yeah, good name drop, Sean. You might as well just come in. Yeah, yeah, might as well. Phil Hughes. Might as well. <laughs> but come to our shop, Phil. Hang out. I guess when this when this is all. <laughs> you know, Nick. When I talked to John Fogarty the other day. <laughs> Yeah, when we were hanging out with John, Jonathan Ross of the Bengals, he gave us his, his, his thoughts. Sean's gotta, Sean, you got to act like you've been there before, man. <laughs> celebrity? Yeah. The celebrity thing. Oh, First off, uh, Phil Lorenzo said. Lorenzo Mata. <laughs> yeah, Lorenzo Mata. My, my best friend now. <laughs> Start name dropping. Yeah. Uh, the time you saw Easton stick at a bar. Uh, twice in two days. And, <laughs> and, and well, you took a picture with him. And I took pictures with him. Two, two a green. Uh, who was the other one? Uh, Kick Tradamus. Like every, every <laughs> verified Instagram. Oh, I hate this. this is not fun for me. This two two a tackle Viola. Green. That goes to Sean Maddock and the Dolphins. Sean, Sean Jaspi just name drop. Mr. Name drop here. There's Silver Antonio Gibson and scripts for Sean Evans for the Titans, Michael Gallucci. We only name drop when it's over 10 million followers. <laughs> That's only happened once. Right. Oh, right. That guy. For Sean Evans. Antonio Gibson Silver goes to Ricky Holbert and the Washington football team. Did I read somewhere that that if it's popular enough, Dan Snyder might stick with the Washington football team forever. There's my homies. Josh Zetz with the Chiefs. Yeah. <laughs> May as well just, just delete them from the league. Yeah, they should move them. I don't know. What, what, what city would need a football team? Um, Is Antonio Gibson green this time? Maybe Austin. Ooh, Austin. Um, you know, there were some, some Raiders to San Antonio rumors for a while. San Antonio could be an interesting... Orlando. There's Julius Thomas, Denver. That's going to be Ricky Holbert and Port the Broncos. Portland. Um, Portland could use like a natural Pacific Northwest Mexico rival. Mexico City. Right, interna go international. London. Uh, Toronto. Toronto. Right. Why are we not in? Why is the NFL not in Canada? Why are we not invading Canada? Donovan McNabb. We got Jake from State Farm. Hall of Fame Jerome Bettis. Is Julius Thomas? I can't imagine he he is. It's been a minute or two since Julius Thomas. He yeah, his last team was in 2017 with the Dolphins. So it's been a it's been a few years for Julius Thomas. What's what's he doing now? 
you know, on 28, August 2018, announced his retirement from the NFL to pursue a doctorate in psychology. He would like to study CTE to help others. Good for him. Good guy Julius Thomas, fighting the good fight, being positive. Doing positive things in this world. A lot of negative to focus on, folks, but guess what? Let's focus on some positives every once in a while. Next box. Big thanks to Nick for ripping open those boxes. Helps his rate go by much, much more quickly. Jalen Ragor, NFL debut. That's a catch right there. Look at that. That's a catch. Devin Duvernay, green. Purple Birds, Nicholas Kasberg with that. Why do, Joe, why do defensive players, Arash is asking, player cards not really popular or hold high value? Well... Are you, are you in a IDP fantasy league? How many of you are? Individual defensive player league? I think, it, like a lot of sports, it's, it's, uh, it's offense that makes the, right? Nor am I. <laughs> I think it's offense, really, that just generates the mo most interest. Same with baseball. Hitters are most likely gonna sell better than pitchers. Basketball, you know. The, the defensive player of the year that only scores 10 points a night is not getting the love. You know, in the secondary market or just in just jersey popularity in general, you know. It's the quarterback, it's the wide receiver, it's the running back that gets that get the love. Ooh, nice, Brady Mosaic there, Karen. And the Buccaneers. Yeah, soccer, you may get some love from defenders. A good center back, like Virgil van Dyke, you know. Some good keepers may, may get some love. But yeah, it's but it's still, it's still Cristiano Ronaldo, Messi, it's Mohamed Salah, it's the strikers that are, you know, that are still going to get the most, most attention. Or creative midfielders, you know, guys like that. They should change that? Who should change that? It's us. Only we can change that. But as long as the market keeps loving, you know, it's nothing the manufacturers can do to increase the secondary market value. It's all us. It's all us. CD Lamb for the Cowboys. Green that goes to Ricky. Exactly, Juan. Like, uh,. Trent Alexander-Arnold's a good example of that because those, those fullbacks end up being wingers and then they just end up being, get a lot of assists, but. But yeah, I mean, something that it's, you know, the manufacturer, all they do is just print the cards. What it goes for on a secondary market, that's up to us. That's up to the market, the public. I mean, every once in a while, you'll have like a generational defensive talent maybe. Maybe they sell a little bit better once their career is said and done, but. Here's another four boxes right there, but it's tough. Like, if you have a good cornerback, right, a defensive back, but they're not getting interceptions because no one's throwing to them because they're that good, so they don't rack up like the sexy, uh, they don't rack up the sexy INT stat, right? So they don't get that kind of love. And there's just a lot of players, you know? There's a lot of defensive backs, you know? Not everyone can be like Deion Sanders. You know, a lot of defensive backs, a lot of defensive ends, pass rushers that are really good, a lot of good linebackers, you know. But there's only one or two, maybe one strong running back per team. Only 32 quarterbacks, you know what I mean? So, so less, I guess, supply in quarterbacks, more demand.
Yeah, I think I think JJ Watt still uh, still sells okay, but yeah, but again, yeah, I mean, I don't know JJ Watt rookies versus Jarrett Siddham rookies. I, mean, I would argue that Jarrett Siddham probably sells for a little bit more if it's like the same car, or same brand, you know. Those quarterbacks will still get the love. I don't know, maybe JJ Watt's a little different, but. All right, there's Tyler Johnson for the Buccaneers, for Karen. Clyde Edwards Hilaire, NFL debut silver. That'll be for Josh Zetz and the Chiefs. Another Clyde Edwards Elair, wow. NFL debut green this time. LaVisca Chenault Jr. green. So the Chenault Jr. will go to Ricky Holbert. And the Jags, another chief for Josh. Remember he had that Genesis, that Lynn Dawson Genesis earlier too, so. Chiefs are doing pretty good in this one. I think the Chiefs were a late pickup, too. I think they were just sitting there for everybody. Uh, yeah, I think that Mahomes Bay... Was there Mahomes Bay? Sorry, I've, I've been eyeing... I've been keeping my eye out for rookies. I'm pretty sure the Mahomes Bay ships, though. Along with, I think Mahomes and Brady are the only, like, quote unquote, the vet commons that will ship. NFL debut, Justin Herbert playing some good football. John G with the Chargers. Surprisingly, the Chargers' defense not playing good football. I thought that would be their strong suit this year, but at least not when they were playing Brady and the Buccaneers. Um, oh, that was the last box. There's no more here. Big thanks to Nick for helping us. Pop open all those boxes, make this break. We save about 15, 20 minutes on the break with those boxes being ripped open. So big thanks to everybody for uh, getting into the action. We've got another full blaster case. Uh, there's the Genesis right there. Another full blaster case in the shop right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Do not miss out. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.